Hey Facebook, this is Jeremy. I'm one of the animal care managers at Cheyenne Mountain Zoo here and I'm here to give you guys a live update on our construction site behind us. Um, where we're at right now that you guys may not understand is we're actually up, up above the exhibit right now, like up above the construction. You can see there's a lot of activity behind us going on right now, which we're going to get into in a minute. But we wanted to kind of stay out of their way today and give you guys an overview of all the work that's been getting done. So it's really, really cool. You can see all that activity down there. A little easier so we're actually perched up on the hillside right above the exhibit um, just below wolf woods and the moose exhibit so that's kind of where we're at if you guys are walking over to primate world you can look up the hill we're just hanging out on some rocks up here so we're going to show you guys a little bit of what's going on so i'm going to step around the camera so i can give you guys a first person tour of this wonderful exhibit so bear with me for a second as i get my place we're going to move over here to our left if you guys remember last week, our um, curator, Jeff Halter, he actually gave you guys a tour of our outdoor penguin area, which is actually this white structure that's hiding behind these trees here. Um, and that's coming along really well um, from the update that he gave us a couple weeks ago. Uh, it's about twice as much of that pool is getting, has gotten done and it's getting worked on continuously still. That bubble's there to help keep it warm so we can make sure we get all the rock work done right. If we pan over here, to just to the right of that a little bit you guys can see this roof structure here and the black curtains that's actually the indoor penguin building and we're really really excited um, they put up all of that so they can start doing all of the work over in that space there so they're starting to form up the pool and get ready to pour all the concrete for the pools there really excited because indoors there just like on the outside we're going to have um, some underwater viewing a nice six foot tall glass that's going to have a nice curved viewing of the penguins underwater there. Um, you're going to have two pools in there with a waterfall cascading down. We're also going to have an aquarium with some really cool fish in there for you guys to see. So when you guys come into the zoo and we're open, you're actually going to be coming out of the exhibit space over there, passing by the penguin pools, and then you'll be entering into the building that way right behind this wonderfully gnarly tree that we're going to be saving. It's going to be a cool feature as well. I'm um, just give you guys a little bit of perspective too. This boulder here was a boulder that when we got flooded in the 1950s, rolled down the mountain and landed there and it hasn't moved since. So that's pretty cool. Um, that used to be in our old crane yard. So if you guys are wondering um, where this is in relation to the old building, that's the, the big boulder that was in the crane yard. So really unrecognizable. And then if we move across over here, where my finger's at now, just behind this bush here. That's actually gonna be the entrance to our hippo building. So you guys are gonna come out of the penguin building, you're gonna kinda of come towards this loader, or this, uh, this, this packer that's right here in this mound of dirt, you know, our public area here. And then you're gonna go straight that direction where this guy's backing up and they're actually currently excavating a bunch of dirt to go into our building. You're gonna cross over a really wide pedestrian bridge that's gonna be over a pool that actually is fed by our hippo pool. So you'll have a natural looking rock work going down in this pool that you'll walk over the top of, have a really cool entrance into our building. This whole front face of our building, that's our hippo building. And all of this is gonna be full of wonderful glass and garage doors so that we're gonna have lots of natural light coming into the building. We're gonna have some skylights coming down. You can see, oh, there's a couple little guys up there working on the roof right now. Tiny little guys. Um, it's uh, it's kind of like a an ant mound out here with so many people working on site doing all kinds of different stuff. Um, and then right here where you see this hole in the concrete, that's actually an underwater shift for our hippo pools. We're really excited about that. So our hippos will be inside and then they're going to have a nice underwater shift to come outside. And all along here, you can kind of see where the concrete wall is excavated out. That's going to be hippo pool. And then actually between this beam here and this uh, other one right here, you're gonna actually, is we have a lemur island going in. So the lemurs are gonna live on this island that's half in the building, half out of the building. The hippos are gonna be swimming around them. It's gonna be really, really neat. We're gonna have some cool features in there to kind of tie in both of those exhibits. Really, really exciting. They're gonna shift in and out there. And then somewhere right about along this line here, we'll transition from public space over here on the left to our exhibit space. So you come over here, and this all from here all the way, way over there where our Primate World building is, this is all going to be hippo exhibit. Um, it's going to have uh, both hippos and warthogs and guinea fowl all living in the same space. It's going to be really, really cool, really fun and awesome. 
Right now, if you guys come to the zoo and you're looking at the construction site, you come in and you'll go to, to go to Primate World, you're gonna follow right along this fence. This is the pathway you're walking on just to give you guys your bearings a little bit and then you walk all the way over here, go into the building. So really, really exciting. Also, a really cool feature that we're gonna have in here eventually, just over here, there's gonna be a landing and from that landing, going over our, one of our hippo exhibits is gonna be super exciting to a big um, overlook over our hippo pools is gonna be this really cool adventure bridge, the rope bridge that people will get to walk on. Super, super neat, really cool experience. You'll be walking along that, maybe you'll have a hippo or a warthog wallowing in a mud hole right underneath you. And then you'll get to hang out right over the water and see those hippos in the water and the lemurs right over there. So it's gonna be really, really neat. And then once you go into the hippo building, you guys are gonna be going through there all the way to the back, walking along the back of the building, popping out way over there where that guy is, that little green structure thin to my finger is, and then going into primate world, just to give you guys some perspective. So that's kind of an overview of what's going on and what you're seeing here. We're really excited. They've actually just started excavating out the pool today. Um, our hippos, um, people are really interested in when our hippos are coming. And that is gonna be coming here probably sometime this summer. We don't have an exact date. We're waiting on to see how the construction goes um, and how everything rolls out. Give me a second while I step on down here so you guys can see me. Um, we're really excited to have our hippos come back. They're gonna be coming back sometime in the middle of the summer. As you can see, there's a lot of work still going on. Walt and the construction team have been working furiously to get this done for us. We're really, really excited about it. So as soon as we start getting a little bit closer to when the exhibits are ready, we'll have a better idea of the exact date when they're coming. But we know it'll be this summer, time, sometime this summer. I'm really, really excited about that. But as you can see, we got people all over. They got people on the roofs, they got people on the ground, they got people in the buildings. Um, the open right now, we don't have a set date for the open. We're kind of gonna be doing a staged open throughout the, uh, throughout the, um, the summer as different exhibits come online. We're hoping that um, maybe our penguin facility will be ready a little bit before everything else. We'll be able to bring those penguins in, get them settled into their exhibit, get them comfortable in that environment, and then open it up to you guys when you come to see. And then as the rest of the exhibit comes online, we'll be able to stage that open for you guys. Really, really excited about that. Um, so we wanna thank you guys for coming out today, or tuning in to listen to us, you didn't come here. Um, and uh, we are gonna be giving you guys plenty more updates over the coming weeks as this exhibit progresses. As you can see, things are happening so quickly day to day. This was all flat ground yesterday, and now it's a giant hole in preparation for the hippo building, or the hippo pool, I should say. Um, so moving really quick, we're looking forward to giving you guys a lot more updates. So I'm sure you'll see me or one of our other staff members giving you those updates. So. Keep tuning in. Thanks for supporting us.